Hey guys and welcome to my channel. Thanks for clicking on this video. Um, if you're new, I would love it if you subscribe to my channel. It means so much to me anytime you guys click subscribe or you like a video or you comment something nice. It means so much to me. So um, thank you in advance and um, I'm actually going to do something that I've never done before and put hair extensions in my hair um, just clip in ones and i'm going to show you guys how i do it i'm going to do a review of the cashmere hair extensions if you've heard of them or haven't heard of them i hope this video is helpful um, they do have an instagram but thank you to cashmere hair extensions for sending me these because i've never worn hair extensions so i'm a little, little bit nervous i'm going to give you my honest review and my opinion um, and we're going to curl them curl my own hair um, curl the extensions so let's get into it okay so if you're like me and you have trouble finding your color um, I would go ahead and um, message the Instagram or um, reach out to cashmere hair they're very helpful when it comes to helping you match your color um, so I'm in the color sunset blonde and I'm gonna take these out and show you guys I love that you have the option to put your extensions in a bag and hang them um, keeping them just such good quality keeping them good for a long time um you want to make sure you're storing your extensions um in a good way and not just like tangling them up so i love that and i'm just gonna i'm just gonna go ahead and take them out okay so they come with a pack of three really big wefts and i'm gonna start with those so um there are instructions on the packet that you get but you're going to take the smallest weft um, I believe it's like the six, number six one or six inches. Um, and I am going to unclip the clips. These are really heavy duty clips. Um, and I'm going to show you guys how I do it and probably do a little voiceover. Okay guys, so I am just starting with the first section and taking the smallest weft of extensions um, with the three or four clips. Um, and I'm just sectioning off. You want to make sure you do it in a U shape so then the ends of the um, hair extension kind of go up a little bit um, in the shape of a U. Okay, I forgot to mention the length of these. These are the 20 inch. Um, mm -hmm extensions and this is about how far down they go and they look crazy because they are not blended <laughs> into my hair right now but you get the point and I will probably be trimming them a little bit and maybe bringing them to my hairstylist so she can trim them and they will look a little bit more natural once I have them curled um so let's go ahead and do the rest so the last few pieces are these just two clip extensions and you're gonna get four of these actually kind of five in total because you will get a sample in your bag um, and you want to make sure you take that out and make sure it matches your hair before you take out everything else so technically you get five of these two um, clips I'm gonna go ahead and angle down in my hair um, that's gonna make it look the most natural the way to look most natural is if you're angling this way down so it kind of doesn't sit straight but it sits kind of at an angle putting them in and clipping them down kind of looks crazy um, and then I'm gonna do one more up here And then you can see that it did give my hair a lot more volume on this side. Um, just, it's obviously a lot more hair, but as you can see, that made them blend even better. Um, so we're going to do the next side. Okay, just like that. And now... I'm gonna go ahead and curl them. Like I said, I've never worn extensions before and they do feel a little bit heavy, but it's not something that I can't deal with um, because the clips really grip onto your hair in a way that's really supportive, not like hurtful on your head. Um, so I just love them and they look a little bit crazy because I haven't curled my hair yet to blend everything in. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Um, I'm a little bit nervous because I've never curled extensions before, but I'm gonna go on like not too high of a heat and I'll be back. So I'm gonna use a curling iron um, that's I think a one, 
a one inch barrel a little bigger than a one inch barrel um not quite one and a half inches though so i'm gonna go ahead and do this and just wrap it around and be very careful this is so weird when you're curling hair that's longer than what you're used to okay first curl is done it makes me a little bit nervous because I don't want the I don't want to put the heat on too long um, but I also want to make sure I get it curled enough because my hair does hold a pretty good curl so I hope that the extension does too and I guess I could have curled them not on my head but I was worried that it wouldn't look as natural since they're all in their place right now Okay guys, I have one side curled and you can see it made it a little bit shorter, um, but I do think I'll still trim these ones. Um, you can of course trim your extensions. So I'm gonna let this cool a little bit and brush it out with my hair and then go to the next side. Okay guys, this is the final product and I will say I need a lot more practice on these. Um, I feel like I probably would recommend curling your hair and then putting the extensions in and curling your hair and the extensions separately um, if you're going to do it that way just because it was a little bit hard. It took me a while um, and I feel like it might just be better to I don't know have the extensions curled already so um, this is the hair I'll put everything forward so you can see how it curled um, the ends are definitely a little bit longer than I would like so I will probably have my hairdresser trim them or I will try to trim them but all in all my review I would say is definitely a positive one I really love them I think I'll probably wear all of them or just a few um, I think next time I will try to wear just a few at a time to see how that looks because sometimes it's just a little too much hair. Um, I'm sure you guys can agree. Um, and yes, I feel like they don't look perfect right now because this is my first time using them. But I still wanted to share this with you guys and hopefully you got a good review from this video. I love them. I would say they are worth the purchase if you're somebody who's going to wear these often or to different occasions or your wedding or something like that so um i love it once again thank you for watching this video i hope that this helped i'll have them linked down below um i got this sunset blonde shade and i think it's my color so anyways i'll talk to you guys next time i film a video and don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you did like it and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys